The Windows 11 activation error 0xC004C003 is a common issue that occurs during the activation process. This error typically arises due to invalid product keys, activation server overloads, or hardware changes on your device. Without resolving this issue, you might not be able to unlock the full functionality of Windows 11. Here are detailed solutions to help you troubleshoot and resolve the error effectively. Solution 1. Run the Activation Troubleshooter One of the quickest ways to resolve activation errors in Windows 11 is by using the built-in Activation Troubleshooter. This tool is designed to detect and fix common activation problems automatically. To access it, navigate to Settings, then System, then Activation, and click on Troubleshoot. Follow the on-screen instructions to complete the process. The troubleshooter will attempt to verify your license or provide specific recommendations to resolve the issue. It is an essential first step in addressing the 0C004C003 error. Solution 2. Update Windows 11 to the latest version. Outdated system files can interfere with the activation process, leading to errors like 0C04C003. To ensure your system is up to date, go to Settings, then Windows Update, and click on Check for Updates. Installing the latest updates not only fixes bugs, but also ensures compatibility with Microsoft's activation servers. Once updates are installed, restart your computer and check if the activation error persists. Solution 3. Use Command Prompt to Activate Windows For advanced troubleshooting, you can use Command Prompt to manually activate Windows 11. Open Command Prompt as an administrator by typing CMD in the Start menu, right-clicking the result, and selecting Run as administrator. In the Command window, type slmgr.vbs slash ATO to initiate the activation process. If this command doesn't resolve the issue, you can also use slmgr.vbs-rearm to reset the license status. These commands are particularly useful if the activation error is caused by temporary glitches in the licensing system. Solution 4. Run System File Checker and DISM Tools Corrupted system files can disrupt the activation process. To repair these files, open Command Prompt as an administrator and run the System File Checker, ESFC, by typing SINFC slash ESCANNOW. This tool scans your system for corrupted files and replaces them with correct versions. After completing the SFC scan, run the DISM tool with the command DISM.XE slash online slash cleanup image slash restore health. Restart your system after running these commands to check if the issue is resolved. Solution 5. Reset Windows 11 as a last resort. If none of the above solutions work, resetting your system may be the most effective option. This process reinstalls Windows 11, resolving any deep-seated issues that may be causing the activation error. To reset your PC, go to Settings, then System, then Recovery, and click on Reset This PC. You can choose to keep your files or remove everything, depending on your preference. After resetting, ensure you have your product key ready to activate Windows again. This method is a comprehensive way to eliminate persistent activation errors. If the issue persists, contacting Microsoft support may be required to resolve activation server-related problems. By following these steps, you can ensure your Windows 11 installation is properly activated and functioning as intended.